Welcome back to my channel, Higher Mathematics, and really interesting challenge today, 2 to the power a minus 2 to the power b equal to 2016. How can you solve this question? In this video, I'm going to fully explain you how we're going to do this step by step. First of all, let's rewrite our challenge. So we have, we have 2 to the power a minus 2 to the power b equal to 2016. So here is our here is our challenge. And obviously a is greater than b. Okay, this is our first step. A is greater than b. This is obviously because we have a positive value on the left hand on the right hand side. Okay, so 2 to the power a is greater than 2 to the power b. And from here we have that a is greater than b. A is greater than b. This is our first step. I hope you understand this. A is greater than B because we have a positive value on the right hand side. What are we going to do next? Let's subtract 2 to the power B. Okay, from here let's subtract 2 to the power B. So we have 2 to the power B and in parentheses what do we have? We have 2 to the power A minus B because we subtract it. Yeah, we have 2 to the power A minus B and minus 2 to the power B if you subtract it we have minus minus 1 which is equal to 2016. Okay, 2016. Okay, what are we are going to do next? Right now I suggest you to write a substitution because a minus b it's not a good right now to, to solve this question like that. So let's write a substitution. So a minus b equal to, for example, let's go with t. Okay, this is our substitution. And right now what expression we have? We have 2 to the power b. So we have 2 to the power b in parentheses 2 to the power t minus 1. 2 to the power t minus 1, which is equal to 2000. 16. Okay, we have this expression right now. Uh, I want to separate these places because I want to continue to solve this question. So right now, uh, let's rewrite this expression right here. So we have we have 2 to the power b in parentheses, 2 to the power t minus 1 equal to 2016. Okay, take a look closely. 2 to the power b is even number. Okay, obviously, yeah, because that doesn't matter how many times you multiply 2 by 2 by 2, we have even numbers. So this is our even number. If you look inside parentheses, we have 2 to the power t minus 1. 2 to the power t is uh, absolutely the same as 2 to the power b is even, yeah. But if you subtract from here 1, we have odd number, okay. This is very important moment. I want you to understand it because this is very important moment in terms of this question. So this is even, this is odd number. And right now let's express this 2016 as a product of even and odd number. So let's do this. I want to do this right here. So let's do this right here on the top. Yeah, we have 2016, okay. And if we divide this 2016 by 2, what do we have? We have 1008, okay, 1008. We can divide it by 2 once more, so we divide it by 2. We have 504, yeah, we have 504. Let's divide by 2 once more. We have 252. By 2 once more, we have 126, yeah, 100, and let's divide it once more, we have 63. Okay, so we have odd number, and we can write this 2016 as 63 times 2 times 2 times 2 times 2 times 2, which gives us 2 to the power 5, okay? So we have 2 to the power b times 2 to the power t minus 1 equal to 63 times 2 to the power 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. Oh, let's write it as 2 to the power 5 times 63 okay i want you to understand this step this is very important important step right now okay right now 2 to the power b and we have 2 to the power 5 right here so it looks like b equal to 5 because we have absolutely the same expression on both sides so 2 to the power b 2 to the power 5 so from here it implies that b equal to 5 yeah i hope you i hope you see this this step this is very important moment so b equal to 5 yeah we have absolutely like the same order right here yeah 2 to the power b 2 to the 4 power 5, 5, 5 so equal to equal to 5 and right now we still have parentheses and we still have this 63 so let's solve this question what do we have right now we have 2 to the power t minus 1 yeah 2 to the power t minus 1 equal to equal to 63 okay equal to 63 how can you solve it? Of course, bring this minus 1 to the right hand side. So we have 2 to the power t equal to 64. Okay, from here 2 to the power t equal to 2 to the power 6. Yeah, we have 2 to the power 6. And from here t equal to t equal to 6. But we don't need our t because we need a and b. We solve this question according to a and b. So how can we find this a and, a and b? We know b, we, we know t. So let's go back to this substitution. So we have a minus b equal to equal to t okay so from here we know b we know t so we have a minus b 
minus b we know that equal to 5 equal to t equal to equal to 6 okay equal to 6 and from here a equal to 11 yeah a equal to 11 let's check this root we have a we have b let's check it let's prove that this is a correct solution to this challenge okay let's do this so right here we have 2 to the power 11 minus 2 to the power 5 equal to 2016 let's look at it let's check it 2 to the power 11 equal to mm, we know that 2 to the power 10 i write it right here 2 to the power 10 equal to 1024 we all know this is like a table case right here so 2 to the power 11 is, is, is this value multiplying by 2 so 2048 so 2048 minus 32 yeah, yeah this is 2016 so this is a correct a correct solution to this to this challenge so let's write our let's write our answer right here so our answer our answer a equal to 11 and b equal to b equal to 5 this is our solution to this to this very tricky tricky challenge i hope you understand my explanation i hope you learn something new this is my main goal on my youtube channel but definitely don't feel bad if you got this wrong if you need help with any of these classes i have a lot of videos on my youtube channel so i hope you enjoy this enjoy this content and thank you for your support thank you for your likes for your comments it inspires me a lot it helps me a lot in my youtube channel so thank you for your time wish you all the best in your life and see you in the next videos